what's good everybody back once again and here trying to go and think about hmm who and what's gonna happen at money in the bank that's right shawty what you think i got money in the bank anyway yeah so you know it's always one of my like bay pay-per-views because a lot of matches i was like i mean come on that's like one of the better like like matches like you know that's not really like a I guess it's a gimmick, but it's not an overall gimmick like Hell in a Cell, like how they made it be, you know. Now, I mean, when Hell in a Cell was good, because it was actually worth it now, it's like, eh. But anyway, I like, I, but I could think you never go wrong with Money in the Bank, even though sometimes the execution on the Money in the Bank, is, I was like, that's different. But the match itself, always good, pretty much. Anyway, uh, huh, I was like, I was trying to think, like, should I go in order of how they probably going to go in order? Um... I feel like, you know, I feel like, you know, if you're going to start to think out, I think you probably need to go and you probably need to have, like, I'm going I'm to just say it. I If it was me, if it was me, I think I'd go ahead and I think I'd just, uh, they're probably going to start off with, with the women's money in the bank. More, more, more than, more than anything. Um... Uh, so I just hope they don't do like a woman cash in at the end on the same night. But I, I feel like that's what they was that's what they're going to do. I think they should go ahead and probably have like uh I'll go with Gunther and Riddle. Now I was like, we ain't gonna be here long. Gunther's gonna win. This ain't even this not this not something that's gonna be like, well, I don't know which way nah nah nah. This is just pretty much gonna be Gunther over here. <laughs> Being Riddle. Uh, now that Riddle, like, I was like, I was like, Riddle gonna take some chops, cause, I mean, everybody take some chops, but Riddle gonna take some chops, cause he, but he's also, like, a good showman, too, where it's like, you know, like, you can see a strong effect. I, this one's just gonna be a little bit cooler in comparison to some of the other matches, cause, like, Riddle, Riddle's a smaller guy compared to, compared to him, but he's not a smaller guy like Ali, or, or, I'm trying to think of, like, like, yeah, like, Rick, like, he's not small like that. So he's going to do probably some like crazy feet things where it's like, oh my god, he picked him up and he would like, like you know, give that good fight. You know, he he sort of hulks up when he does his little thing. You know, get through the little like mad bro thing going on. But it's Gunter. That we ain't gotta be here all day. Gunter's gonna gonna beat him. Um, then I was like, the next up, uh, the women ladder match. Um. It's a weird cast that I'm not too thrilled about. Like I, so normally sometimes I am, you know, because uh, nor I was like, like, even though you might know who probably is going to win a lot more of these things, the cast of characters that is what sort of makes it. And this one, I, it's because you know, like, because you got like Trish Stratus and you got Zoe Starks, and they're sort of doing a similar thing to EO and Bailey. That sort of makes that like a whoever wins there, you could say the same thing. Uh, Becky doesn't. I, I was like, I don't. I was like, I think she'll vent, vent, win it one day, but I don't think she's going to win it here. Not that she needed anyway. Zelina, I feel like after her big showing in Puerto Rico, that that I think that I think this is really just her. Just like they like they're showcasing her, they're putting her in matches, they're putting her in places. And I was like, that's what I think that she's gonna get. I don't think she's gonna get the briefcase or the title match. I mean, now would it be cool because she got the whole LWO thing and you know like with German Day, like they can rehash that maybe. But I, it's it's not it's not really here. I don't think Bailey will because Bailey won it a few years ago, and. So, and I was like, she's sort of like Becky, where it's like, she's always sort of like a threat in that nature. EO, I, I was like, it's everybody biggest pick. Everybody biggest pick. And it's like, it's not that I don't see why I'm not like that. She's the biggest pick. And I think, I was like, it, it's obvious and, it's and everything like that. And that would have sort of made it, it would have been cooler, I feel like, if... They like she would have lost Bianca. Bianca still stayed champion on like a bigger run, and then she beat her at like SummerSlam. But since Oscar got the pick, I was like, you know, that's gonna be that would be a good match too. But it's more so like a like execution with a lot of with, with like these things. But I think I think Eo's gonna pick it. 
I think my dark horse would be between Trish and, and Zoe. While it would be cool, I guess, for Trish to have it, I don't see her actually having it. Uh, I think she's. I, it's like I like I feel like she's going to actually get a title match. Well, I mean, Ripple Rhea's the champion now, so that sort of makes that a little different. Like if it was Bianca, I would have felt like she would have get a title shot. I don't know about with Rhea, but. I feel like Trish is sort of like still like, you know, like she's a legend where she could sort of get into it, but it would be cool to have Trish the legend and her just sort of like, like hovering around each, each spot. Just like, I got, like, I got the briefcase. I've been here before, like that type of thing. But on the other hand, you would see for Zoe getting it because since she is new, what is sort of a bigger way to get us, have somebody have it than her. But because she paired up with Trish, you know, that could be a weird dynamic just because you got a lot of, like, mentor, mentorees, like, in the same match. That sort of makes it where it's just like, okay, so if, at some point there will be a falling out. But EO, I feel like there would be a falling out with Dem Bailey versus Zoe falling out with Trish Stratus. Depending on if Zoe, like, if Zoe takes out Trish Stratus, that's a different ballgame. But I think Star's getting it. Then I feel like, I'm like, Trish is still top person. But I think having her quote unquote lackey or whatever you want to say, having the briefcase, I feel like it would be different than like when Austin Theory won and everybody felt like that was like rushed and crazy and all that other stuff. Just because I was like, even though Zoe had to been there long enough or had gotten like any momentum, because she sort of has like a mentor and it's like it's, it's well, it's more guided and it doesn't seem as pushed at, in the same way. But I still will go with EO. I think she still takes it. Um, I was like, I was like, she's she's also very charismatic, so I don't see that as being a problem. All right. So then the next one where I like feel like okay, cool. So you need like a like a like a breathing match. I say is probably going to be uh, probably be. I think it's gonna be Cody and Dom. I think Cody wins this one, and because mainly because I was like. Uh, this 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 doesn't really seem like one of them things where it's like like Dom is very over or as a heel or I guess that would be the right way of saying it. But I think that's I think that's sort of what makes him good as this heel because it's like he's going to get beat by Cody, but ain't going to stop him from being how he's been either. Um, I I also just can't see him racking up a loss at another pay-per-view when it'd be sort of the he basically won for four if he lost to Dom uh starting off like you know since WrestleMania on I doubt and also to the Dom it's it's also really because it's Dom that I I feel like that he that you you can't I feel like you can't really lose to Dom because they had they made him not it made him into a heel but not a heel that should like necessarily like really win. He win by things and stuff and Rhea and the job. Like that's how he wins. And I, I was like, I but I, I still feel like nah, they're gonna have Cody be like, like take him to school. It, it is what it is. Um, I was like, next match, I think, uh, I think they'll probably go and do like the tag team title. Um, no. You still have, I was like, no, nah, you still, I think in this one, I think this is when you're going to get, uh, I think this is, I think they might, you know what they might do? They might do the tag team match. I'm, I'm just spitballing. But I was like, Ronda Rousey, Shayna Baszler, going to be Raquel and Liv. They just won the titles. I was like, uh, so was, I feel like it's too late to take it off of them. Plus, they're sort of, it's sort of been like what they've been wanting to do of putting the tag team titles on them, an actual team that could both be dominant and crazy and basically going to like hold no prisoners, take no prisoners and all this other stuff. Yeah, so they're, they're going to win. They're going to sort of dominate over like Liv, uh, Ronda and Liv and have their little things, so beefs and like single matches. So as Shayna and Liv, so I, I, I think that they just overtake both of them in this situation. Um, yeah, it's just, just really anything. Um, so, obviously, the last, like, uh, you know, couple of matches that's, like, left 
here is probably all like bangers and I felt so I was like didn't really separate it out so I was like my we're gonna just trash how uh, I set it up but I think uh, I think they're going to go and have the men's uh, money in the bank and have the two title people holders main event that way you can always have the thought of oh is somebody gonna cash it in it's some, you know cause I was like they don't have a um, I was like, they don't have, like, the women's uh, championship this time. So, I was like, you ain't got to worry about that. Um, anyway, so in the men's, I think it's a better cast of characters. Uh, obviously, Ricochet and Santo is not going to win, so we can throw them out. Uh, which, I mean, and I was like, my, my, if I, I think I was picking, I would want Shinsuke, but that's me. I was like, uh, I feel like LA Knight is going to take it. Um, I feel like Logan Paul is going to give everyone a scare that he's going to take it. Um, yeah, I like, like, to be honest, like those three are sort of what I, I would say. I would say LA Knight, Logan, and then like, uh, uh, Shinsuke in there. Um, like, I mean, Shinsuke, I feel like it's good enough to win it. And I think he'd be a good character with it. That's why I like it. And it's not like I don't. It's not that I don't like L.A. Knight from uh, like uh, from. I was like I, I'm not gonna act like I like see him a lot. I was like I did sometimes watch his promos and stuff like that. I was like and obviously that good. Um, but yeah, no, I, I think I think to be honest, it's, it's L.A. Knight versus Logan Paul. That's real. That's what it is. So it's like Logan Paul, the guy that's seen everywhere. Where it's like, oh snap! If he has to breathe case, he could show up anytime and whenever he showed up, it's always gonna pop. It's always gonna be something. He's a good heel. He I'm like he'll be shown everywhere. It's gonna be in his background. It's gonna be right next to the prime and stuff like that. And you know, a lot of people hate Logan Paul. I really, I, I was like, he's like it's whatever to me. I don't really like care. I mean, like I like I like him. Have be outside of that. I mean, I watch other stuff. I was like, I but I remember him from like being the Vine guy and stuff like that. So he doesn't bother me. I know why he sort of bothers some people, but I but in my head I'm like, if he bothers you, you should hate a lot of people. And it's like we pick and choose on that. But yeah, no. So I was like, I, I feel like I what I feel like is that Logan Paul gonna get up there. He's gonna get so close, and there and he's gonna scare everybody. Scare everybody. And then, like, Damian Priest comes out of nowhere, choke slams him. And somebody takes out Damian P P uh, Priest. And then L.A. Knight climbs up to the ladder and takes it. And I, 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 was, I was like, I don't know, that's going to happen. But I feel like Logan Paul will get up there to where everybody's going to be like, huh? And L.A. Knight takes it. Uh, next match, uh... Rollins, Finn Balor. Uh, I feel like Finn should win, but I think Seth is gonna win. Uh, I don't think this. I don't. I think this rivalry will continue to happen because of the way that you know. Kind of like I feel like what the, the story they'll try to tell is that this time Seth beats Finn instead of the other way around from how it was when Finn first won his championship, and that would be the story. And then I think they'll have. Another match at like SummerSlam or something like that, where I could see Finn, Finn actually taking it. But I think Seth just won it. It's too early for that, so it's really just going. I think it's just going to be Seth just taking it in, in in a fight, pretty much. And I was like, all his uh, all the other Judgment Days are already being busy, occupied with other matches and stuff. So it's just going to be Seth. It's too short of uh, of a title run and. So that that's really what I mean, and plus, self is really a good you know not a fin is not also like a good hand of making a good match and stuff like that. But I I think they're going to try to set it up to have all of them sort of like be meaning with something. Rhea got the title, I was like so I could see if they try to like you know like hold off on that just a little bit. But also with that is why I don't see Damian winning the winning the briefcase. I. Just, but because I was like, if I feel like Finn is going to get the championship at some point, and that make things obviously awkward. But I don't think they're gonna—they're they're really gonna break them up now. 
Uh, and last match, the Civil War. Who will be the ones? Um, I actually this this is probably the one match, the one match that I can think of that I'm like I actually don't know who's going to win. Just because you can make a case for every single person, you can make a case for uh Ro solo lose solo taking the pin to have Roman lose, but he's not gonna lose. I don't think they'll. I don't think. I don't, I was like because Roman had to been pinned. I couldn't see them doing that this pay per view of being a pin. I could see them in some type of. I was like, but then again. He's not really gonna probably be in other tag team matches to where you can let him have a pin, but he doesn't lose his title. You know what I'm saying? Um, but I can also see the Uso lose because of something, or maybe they don't. Maybe, maybe they they try not to hit. So they maybe they maybe they something with Solo where they're just like, like I know you don't try to give us the beats and stuff like that, and they trying to talk to him. Like, you know, like, actually, like, during the match, you know, like, you know, like, like, they've been fighting the whole match, but they just, like, come to the part where it's just, like, well, yo, we trying to compromise or whatever, like, blah, 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 and then Roman just, like, spears, knocks him out or whatever like that, and pretty much get the victory in that type of way. Um, and also, too, I also, to me, just me, I think that, I, I was, like, even I was like, even though I know everybody wants it to be Jay and stuff like that, I would want, I sort of wanted to play out where Jimmy gets a championship shot against Roman. Get, I, I know this, I know this is off topic of the actual man. Get beat, and that causes Jay to be like, nah, nope, this ain't, nah, because then he's like back to, you know, solo Jay or whatever or something like that. But I also want Jimmy a chance to shine, uh, which is why I'm going to say. That Jimmy picks up the victory versus Solo to set that up. That's how I'm going because Roman's gonna get mad at Solo for for losing. Uh, I guess essentially, uh, uh, no, 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 this wasn't again. But have Solo lose, but he loses to Jimmy, who started the whole thing. And Roman's like, "All right, I got to do this on my, you know, I'm trying to be on some Thanos." And be like, I, I I gotta do this myself. But he's like, I'm not gonna go after Jay first, cause I feel like maybe like maybe he still feel like I could still will him to the side or something or like that. Anyway, but pretty much, he's like, I'm gonna take out him, Jimmy. And that and also too, full circle. That's how Jay got wrapped up in it, cause he was fighting until he started taking out Jimmy. But that's my pick, Jimmy pin solo and starts. A different reign of terror. But anyway, that's my money in the bank picks. Oh man, it went longer than I expected. Anyway, if you agree, disagree, like, you know, got your own thoughts or whatever, uh, let me know. Uh, if you liked any of this, I appreciate it. Thanks. If not, hey, maybe next time. But until then, peace. I'm out.